I want to thank you. My name is Julia Kelly. I'm from the Exaloga Nation. Julia Kelly just took over as CEO of the Trickster Cultural Center in Schaumburg. A key part of the center's mission is amplifying the stories and contributions of native veterans, like the Code Talkers, who use native languages to transmit secret messages for the U.S. military. Everybody has a different reason for going into service. Mine was to escape domestic violence. And I can tell my story now because it's important for any of anybody else that's in the same situation to know that you can come out front. You can be a survivor. Kelly spent 28 years in the Army, working her way up to leadership positions. She served two tours in Iraq. I am proud to have served and I am proud of all the skill sets I learned along the way because those skill sets and those experiences it is what has made me today. For Veterans Day, she traveled to Washington, D.C. So it was overwhelming. To witness the official dedication of the National Native American Veterans Memorial on the National Mall. It felt really good to be around all of the Native Americans from all directions. And you could feel the energy of what has been a long time coming. Despite the country's painful history, the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs says American Indians and Alaskan Natives serve in the military at a higher rate than any other group. This is our homeland, so we are going into the military to protect that. And Kelly says all veterans deserve to be lifted up in gratitude. That simple thank you for your service you would be surprised how sometimes you will save somebody just by that simple act of being kind. Gaynor Hall, WGN News.